birds. I see the whole gay bird in front of my whole two eyes. Two. Two eyes. I had to come here and tell them about it. Listen. <laughs> Happy earlier today. Hold on. This nigga, y'all, that... Hold on, let me wait for some more people to get on here. Let me... Because y'all got to hear this story. Because this is a good story. You know, we hear a lot of shit, but we don't never really get to see that shit. Because these niggas, they hiding. Listen, y'all, they're hiding behind the 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 covers in the sheets around this bitch. The covers in the sheets. You feel me? The covers in the sheets. Hiding. They're hiding. So, I haven't, you know, discussing some shit with this nigga. We have some... We were doing some business, me and this dude. Now, I'm going to tell you, he did give me some head way back a long time ago. Lo long time ago, a couple of years ago, like before I started fucking with Fran or something, I took, no, he wasn't even, no, he wasn't even there. It was after, okay, it was about two years, how was it two years ago? About two years ago. I think when I first got, was on Orchard, he gave me some head. That's when it was, you know. Okay, so when I was on Orchard, then he gave me some head, right? Never really talked to him like that. You know, I had the old man. I had a lot of other shit going on. So I never talked to the nigga like that. Listen. No, listen, listen, listen. So I was doing some business with this nigga, right? Hold on. I had to run in there and still take my phone and run out. They chased me out the house. Hold on. Pants hanging and they're right there. Hold on. Screaming, Howville. <laughs> they was I said, fuck Howville. I don't give a fuck. You niggas better give me some money. I'm fucking telling everybody. You niggas got some money? We Howville. Ain't nobody. Fuck Howville. Howville gonna have to pay. Because if not, it's just a story to be told. Oh, uh, y'all don't want to pay? Bitch, you was get, I let you give me some head and you had our fucking niggas in their ass? Oh, no. Oh, no. This is not going to fly. No, it's not. And I feel disgusted. I've been sick all day. I've been sick all day thinking about how I let you suck on my motherfucking pussy. And you're over there hitting the fudge out the back of niggas. I can't. I can't stomach it. But they say you far east side niggas been doing that shit. I ain't never seen that shit. Listen, I never seen that shit with my own two eyes. But today, I've been scoring for life. But today, I'm trying to move forward. Today has been one. Today, I've been traumatized. You niggas out here traumatizing bitches. Pull down on this nigga. Hold on. I grabbed what I came to get or whatever. He's like, come on over here to my uncle's house or whatever. Boom. Familiar with your uncle's house. Had been over there before once or twice or something like that. You know what I mean? So I had grabbed whatever, but I'm in a rush. Because I got to get back to the shop or whatever, you know, or whatnot. So, boom. I'm riding down the street. I done got the nigga being Speedway, right? I'm damn near to the tire shops on 16th Street. I'm like, fuck. I don't let my phone. So, I start calling my phone. And I start calling his phone. And wasn't was nobody answering on my shop phone. I got a flip, a little phone, a little flip. That's my shop phone, right? So, girl, Yeah. So I'm on my little shop flip phone, and I'm like, boom, calling my cell phone, calling this phone. He don't, ain't want nobody answer. So I'm like, damn. So now I done got back over there. I done parked right up by the front door, though, thank God, because they chased me out of there. They was trying to kill me. Y'all, they tried to kill me, so anything happened to me. Y'all know they tried to kill me today. Them niggas. And then when I got in the car, I started talking shit. If anybody knows me, that's how I get down. As soon as I get to the car, I get close to my pistol. I'm really talking shit now. So wait a minute. So look, I'm in here. Hold on. I, I, I'm banging on the door. I'm like, boom, boom, boom. So I'm knocking on this motherfucking door. I'm like, I need my fucking phone. That's my money bag. I'm like, hitting this motherfucking door. And I'm like, when nobody comes to the fucking door, right? I'm like, damn. Something told me to check the door. That motherfucker was unlocked. When I stepped in there, y'all. When I stepped, oh my God, my stomach hurts. My stomach hurts. When I walked in there, y'all, what I seen with my own two eyes. Hold on. Thank God my phone was sitting on the table right there by the door. I swung that door, but I said, oh. And I was just, I, was, I couldn't even talk the words, the words, the words. I couldn't get the words out of my mouth, right? So I'm like, 
I'm trying to breathe. I'm like, and I just looked down and see my phone. I snatched my phone. They were standing there just staring at me. So, them motherfuckers looking like the devil. They was looking like they was really trying to kill me. So, I just grabbed my phone off my so I was like, so I jump in, so running. I done jump back in my car. Remember I told y'all parked up by the door, right? So, I get in my fucking car. And as I'm backing out, I'm like, hey, you motherfuckers, y'all better come up off some money. Y'all be talking that big money and shit. Give me a couple of bands or something now. Because this right here, this is unacceptable. I'm out the window like, you motherfuckers is trifling. And you bitches think y'all ain't going to get me. So wait. Dude said, come on back. I said, nah. You on bullshit. I was like, motherfucker, send it. Cash at me, motherfucker. I said, if you don't cash at me in the next hour, I'm telling the whole goddamn city what the fuck's going on. I was just, I told him just cash at me five bands. That's all. Shit, you in a $50,000 truck? I can't get five bands? I can't get five bands? So I was just like, get sent, cash at me five bands. That's it. And I ain't gonna sell a soul. You know, it won't be nothing on nothing. Huh. That motherfucker, look, I called his phone. He kept saying, bitch, I'm Hallville. Bitch, ain't nobody gonna go against. I said, who the fuck is Hallville? Don't nobody give a fuck about Hallville? Who the fuck? Does anybody know what the fuck is? How, what the Hallville was? I was just sitting over there. I got a bag on how, at Hallville. I'm setting you bitches faces and made a bag. What are you talking about? Enough to get me to my next location. So fuck a Hallville. Who are ya? Hallville, who is it? Anybody left? Who is this nigga? And so, hold on. I gave this nigga Apple opportunity. I even gave him an extra hour to come up with the money. I was like, listen, just run me the bag and I'll just try to forget. But at the same time, nigga, you could have let me know you was getting down like it. He said, bitch, I ain't got to tell you shit, bitch. I don't owe you no explanations, bitch. He's talking like a G, though. This nigga talking like he on gin, though. This nigga is talking like he's on gin, though, okay? I'm telling you, he's talking like a G. I said, boy, they told me they was doing it out east, but I didn't know y'all was doing it out west like this. I believed out east. I done heard about out east. I heard about you niggas out east getting nasty than a bitch about a bag. Y'all niggas, hey, out east, them niggas getting 20, 30 off white men of her. I don't know. But what I am going to say is, Jamal, you got the right bitch today. Because I take it personal because you gave me, I, you administrated head on me before. So now I got to go, well, I stay in the hospital. So you know what I mean? They, I probably would have known if something would have happened to me behind the shit. But at the same time, you're not safe. You're not safe. You know, it's been a long time really since I touched you like that or whatever. But motherfuckers ain't safe out here, y'all. It's definitely not safe. They're sick. They're nasty. And they're just out here to get bitches. And they're out here. To sh Man, that shit is real. That shit y'all see in ATL, that shit is so fucking real. And it's starting to come down. It's, it, it, it's tumbling down to our city. They're taking over. Everybody needs to check their nigga out straight up because these niggas are playing like they this and that and got the keys to the city and all this and that. And they under the sheets and the covers. So I'm just saying, at the end of the day, I've been super traumatized today about some niggas once again because... I had to witness some shit that I didn't come to see or nothing like that. And I don't appreciate it either. Because you know what? If you get down like that, nigga, you need to let motherfuckers know. You don't just do that kind of shit and just think it's okay. And you was looking at me like you was going to do something to me. Bitch, I'm out of here. Yeah, bitch. I want to let them go right out of my little car, honey. I don't move without my pistol. Never, bitch. Should have went to the door with that motherfucker. Good thing I didn't. Then pop one of them niggas. Hey. All I'm saying is, guys. You females don't make it no better. Y'all keep accepting these niggas back. And they just nasty. And they just do what the fuck ever they want to do and stuff. And now they just getting wild. I guess they just tired of us bitches. Now they fucking each other and shit. The shit's getting wild. All I'm saying is, be safe. Boat up. Boat up on your dude. Boat up. I'm telling you, boat up on these niggas. Because ain't no telling what's, what's going on. I don't seen this shit right here. I'm air by suspect. <laughs> after, after this right here, 
All you niggas is suspect until I determine otherwise. All you niggas on the list. All you niggas. Mm-mm. Mm-mm. I'm cool. I should have known. You know what, though? I'm going to tell you what the first clue was. The nigga was getting his toes done. This should have told it right here. The nigga was getting his toes done, y'all. And you know how you can change the face on live? You can change the face of the person that, you know, like you're looking at them. He was changing them into men and stuff. I understood what he was changing into, like, women or characters. But when you was changing them into men, why do you have the men on your feet, baby? What are you doing here? I'm like, I thought that was weird. That was the clue. See, it be clues. It be signs. I, and I just showed somebody that shit and was like, ain't this weird in a bitch? Why is he turning the camera into a man touching his feet? I thought that was disgusting. That wasn't number two weeks ago. And man, here we go. I walked into a mess. I walked into some smutty, nasty, disgusting shit. And I'll probably never be the same. I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> Star. Star. I'm going to never be the same. Never. And these little dusty ass niggas, they got to be stopped. They're fucking disgusting. Now I'm wondering where you got the money for this truck and shit. You're probably fucking white men downtown. You hang downtown all the goddamn time. You down there fucking them white men. What's going on out here in these streets? For the better of Indianapolis, for the greater Indianapolis, you niggas need to knock that shit off. Y'all infesting our little town. We all going to be dead. I ain't touching nothing else. I don't want no head off you niggas or nothing else. I'm cool. I'm cool. Y'all done show me what time it is around here. Shit, I thought we were safe. We sorry than a bitch around here. Y'all ain't got to worry about it. But one thing for certain, two things for sure, that bitch will never be back on this line a day in his motherfucking life. Mm, bitch, you should have just paid the bread. You the one walking around like you got so much motherfucking money. Nigga, well, you better get, you could have, you should have got me quiet then. 5,000, I would have thought maybe that you were sincere about being girl right. You would have ran me about 5 G's. I would have thought that, you know what I mean? I could have maybe took you seriously. You maybe, you know, I don't know, but you you declined. Or you thought you was going to scream that Hallville shit and thought somebody was going to give a fuck about that shit. I don't give a fuck about a Hallville. Nigga, I sat over in Hallville by myself and made a bag. Was leaving out of there with hundreds every day. What are y'all talking about? I don't give a fuck about fuck a whole deal. The fuck? Dusty motherfuckers. And now y'all out here passing out shit. Anything else? I don't know what y'all got going on. But what you're not going to do is never get back on my line again, you weird ass motherfucking dude. But today was your day to get exposed. Clearly, today was your day. Because I'm here to tell you. I'm at the top of the mound. I'm telling it like Moses. Like I told you I was going to do. And I told you I was going to do this. Motherfucker. They, ch hey, they chased me out the house though. Hold on. They motherfucking pants was hanging. Hold on. God. Wait a minute. Listen. Listen. I've never seen such. Thank God for the people that were outside and shit and kids and shit. They had to stop at the door. Because they got the top of apartments. They got the little hallway. They had to stop at the door. Because there were kids and shit getting out of school and stuff. And people outside, thank God. But I hopped in my truck and was, I mean, hopped in my car and was talking hella shit. <laughs> I was talking hella shit. Boy, hey, everything I wanted to say, I couldn't say at that moment. But after I got to my car, I told them motherfuckers the truth about they trifling asses and told them how fucking dare you motherfuckers. Ugh. Ugh. And you kept on trying to tell me this one, this nigga was your cousin. So it wasn't your cousin? Or wasn't he? I don't know. Y'all got, I don't, I mean. Mm. And kept having them in your videos all the time. Just some dude I had never seen in a day in my life. And come to find out, you and this nigga sticking and moving. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. But I'm about to have to get out here, y'all. Because I got some shit going on. But I just. I had to just get this off of my chest. I had to just 
bring it to the community because this type of shit right here, it got to be stopped. And if something happens to me or something like that, at least you guys know the truth. Okay, because he he's quite upset about the change of events that have occurred at this point. And uh, I don't even know who the weirdo he had with him or nothing or none of that. But all that Javier shit, I don't care about it or none of that. But the truth is the truth and it is what it is. And next time, take my, my threats for real. I don't know. Why would we'll make, we'll make you think I won't go tell nobody? That's what I'm trying to figure out. Nigga, I don't fuck with you like that. You weird ass nigga. This, these niggas is really crazy. I'm Hoville. Okay. You're Hoville. Nigga, I'm behind the fear, bitch. I'm behind the fear. <laughs> you know what I mean? I used to look down the street from the Kia. Nigga, who cares? Who fucking cares? The ghetto boys was living next door to me. Who cares? The fuck? Listen. <laughs> I, was, I was in Homeville. Nigga, no, nobody give a fuck about that shit. Y'all fucking and y'all freaking in Hallville. I've had enough of it. So, from here on out, y'all, y'all better check these niggas out straight up. I mean, I'm talking about taking back to the third grade, talk to the principal. I'm talking about we got to really start checking these niggas out because I would have never thought in a million years this nigga was going to come out of a bag like this today. This right here, it, it, it just killed my little heart because you be trusting people. You do believe, believe in people. When they show you, you totally different from what you really thought. These niggas got on masks, y'all. They got on whole masks. Be safe out here. That's the only thing I can say is be fucking safe. Be safe. I'm, I'm disgusted, but it's going to be all right. But if anybody needs any tires, come on out, Castleton. <laughs> Tons of tires. I got them all. I got tons of them. And uh, I'll get back with y'all.